What's up and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm gonna do something a little bit different, a bit of a sneaker review, where I'm still gonna connect the dots to culture and business. As you saw at the start of the video, I'm a big fan of the MoMA. And the shoes I've got here are part of the recent Vans MoMA collaboration that dropped last month. Let's see what we've got in this very dope looking box. There we go, the Kandinsky slip-ons. I just love these. The Vans slip-on in general is a classic shoe. Thanks to its clean lines, low cut, and sort of loafer-like vibe, it's very versatile. It can generally be worn in your more streetwear kind of outfits as well as dress up. And this pair just takes things to new levels. It's always really cool to have a sneaker where no two angles of the shoe look the same. But I feel like on these, they really nailed it. The color, the print, it's all just super well executed and it still maintains a lot of versatility. I feel like these just look very cool and very classy. They're still gonna work with uh, all kinds of different fits. Uh, even the insoles are asymmetrical. You've got one black, one white, super cool. And in looking at these, one of the things that you might say is, oh, isn't that cool that they've still been able to weave in some of that iconic Vans checkerboard print into the sneaker, but wait, Let's take a look at the full piece that this pair is based on. So here we've got it. This is called Orange by Wassily Kandinsky, 1923. And boom, that checkerboard print was actually there all the way back in 1923, a collaboration that was clearly meant to be. Kandinsky is generally considered the father of abstract art, and he painted orange while teaching at the Bauhaus School a school whose design principles are still regarded as highly influential today on modern architecture, products, and fashion, as well as the overall idea that mass production can still infuse craftsmanship, something that totally resonates with sneaker culture. So in short, this sneaker connects to art as well as to broader movements that have inspired a lot of business and industry today. Thanks for tuning in.